You know, what we're talking about 70 years and the history involved in this. And the thing is, the Free Care Fund actually started before the telethons on TV. That's right. Media got involved well before that. And KDKA's own Bob Pompiani takes a look back at the rich history. In 1890, when Pittsburgh opened its first hospital for children, the hospital's founders made a promise that no child would ever be denied medical care regardless of their family's ability to pay. 133 years later, that promise continues, thanks to the Free Care Fund. The Pittsburgh Press and the Press Old Newsboys first began raising money for the Free Care Fund back in 1933. Then in 1946, KDKA Radio began partnering with the press. And in 1954, KDKA TV joined the team to begin broadcasting this annual holiday telethon, and we haven't stopped since. Welcome once again to our annual Children's Hospital program, and tonight appropriately titled The Magic of Christmas. But of course, everyone knows that children are really the magic of Christmas, and that's why we are here this evening for very special children, the children at Children's Hospital. Though. Hello, everyone. I'm Patty Burns. I'm Ray Tannehill, and at least seems like just yesterday that we stood here in front of these phones, Patty. Forty years. I can't believe it. Dad's been doing this show. Yeah, I know. And here we are again asking for your help for the children. In fact, over 100 years ago, they made a commitment to this community, and that is that no child shall ever be denied medical care. And that promise is just as sacred today as it was more than a century ago. This is a very special night for all of us. And we'd like you to call. We like the money that folds, but we'll take the change tonight. So give us a call. And who is this little one here? And this is Gianna. She's here just crawling around. So you see how precious these kids are. So make a difference. Make a donation tonight. Countless people have had a hand in the telethon, both on air and behind the scenes. So many, in fact, that we couldn't even begin to try to name them all. But all along, this telethon has always been and always will be about the children and the incredibly generous spirit of Pittsburghers who donate to help them year after year. 